Hello everyone. In this video, we will learn how to use awk command in Linux Unix environment. AWK or awk is a text processing utility in Linux. You can use it to show certain columns or certain rows from a text file, search for a certain string or pattern. Awk is mostly used for pattern scanning and processing. It scans a file line by line and produce formatted reports. It searches one or more files to see if they contain lines that match the specified patterns and then perform the associated actions. Awk is mostly used for processing the text base and even nomadic data, either in files or data streams. Here is the basic command usage where it will print the whole contents of a flat file. So for example, we have this file. Let's see how we can use the awk command. Let's use the print command without any parameter. So print with no options mean print the whole line and dollar zero means print same thing, print the whole line. So omitting dollar zero gives the same result. Dollar one refers to the very first field and all zero displays the whole file just like cutting the file. If the file has a comma as a field separator, then you can use the F parameter and comma as a field separator like this. Now we can see the field separator comma, we can display the first column of the file. In its simplest usage, awk is meant for processing column oriented text data such as tables. The variables $1, 2 and so forth are the contents of the file first and second columns and so on. For example, to print the first and second columns of a file which is comma separated, you might use the command like this. Let's add second column here. In this case, you can use a comma, a column or a pipe symbol as the input field separator add a comma as a field separator. Now see the difference between previous and this command where we have comma as a field separator. Let's use a different field separator here. See the result. And so in this case F option defines a your field separator, which is a comma inside the file, while the comma or a pipe or column symbol within double quotes inserts a customized delimiter in the output result. If you want to send the output to the sort command using the shell pipe, let's see how we can do that. Let's sort the result set on field number three. Let's use the same command without sorting. Now you can see the result. See the difference. Let's put the unique option. Now see the result. Let's add C to count the result set. See the difference. Sometimes you have a header in a file that you want to intact without getting sorted out, the column header especially. So let's see how we can do that. For example, we have a file where we have the column headers like this. Let's see how we can keep the column headers intact without sorting them out. Let's use the previous command. So to achieve this, we will use dash n r k nine option let's see this here we can see the title of the column is on the top of the column let's see the original result set so without using an rk9 option you can see the title of the column is not at the right place now see the result so this is how you can keep the column header intact without sorting that out in the result set. Thanks for watching this video.